G'day, I'm Mark Latham, and today I'm up and at them, having a look at the Australian Greens and their desire to make us a genderless society. Now you can tell a lot about a political party by the propaganda they willfully put out, the stuff they're proud of. So have a look at this from the web page of the New South Wales Greens. Doesn't it tell you a lot? Have a look at them. What a collection. You can see Richard Di Natale there, the federal leader of the Australian Greens, and just to his right, how apt it is. The person with the pink hair and the painted face, that's Pennywise, isn't it? It's got to be Pennywise. The Stephen King character, now quite famous in a movie that all the young people are watching. How appropriate for the Australian Greens to have an evil clown among them in this uh, propaganda, otherwise promoting their campaign for gay marriage in Australia. And then further to the right, you can see the New South Wales Senator, Lee Rhiannon, ex-com, Lee Rhiannon, and just to the right of her, probably the most telling aspect of the photograph is the woman there, perhaps a woman, with the t-shirt, gender is over. That says it all. This is their desire for a genderless society. Now, of course, they're making inroads with this. They've wiped biological science. The Greens say, oh, you've got to listen to climate science. Well, how about listening to biological science? People are born either male or female. Okay, just because a bloke puts on a dress, it doesn't make him a woman. And even Tony Abbott, he's pulled his head in recently. I wish he was saying this when he was Prime Minister. He'd still be there in the lodge. He has written, just last month, a man is not a woman just because he wants to be. How true. A man is not a woman just because he wants to be. Well, we need to tell that in the Australian Defence Forces where we're spending a million dollars a year on sex change operations. Transgender, Trump had the right idea to put in place the transgender ban in the military. And of course, in the school system, a lot of this is being gamed by kids, looking for attention, maybe playing a prank. The figures in Victoria have come in for this year's Year 12 leaving exam in Victoria. 51 students identified as Gender X. So either the safe schools madness is working down there, the kids are confused, big number, 51, gender X, or they're just having a bit of a prank, gaming the system as young people in the, in the schools sometimes do. In the census last year in Australia, we only had 1,300 transgender. So well, overwhelmingly for your average Australian, gender is alive and well, gender is not over, but we've got to be wary of these greens. If they've got Pennywise on their side, the evil clown, You've got to keep an eye on these characters. They are truly demented. I'm Mark Latham for Rebel Australia. And if you like that video, please share it with your family and friends on social media and please support our campaign to fight against lawfare, malicious legal defamation suits to try and close down Rebel Australia and Mark Latham's Outsiders. Please support us at standwithlatham.com.